10. Time Management Tips for Achieving Your Goals We all have something peculiar to every one of us. Time. The way you use yours determines the type of result you'll get eventually, likewise everyone else. Perhaps, to help us understand better, we can say self-management. It is how well we manage ourselves to maximize the time, 24 hours, available to us as we maximize productivity because, in the real sense, it's not about how much time you have but how effectively you can manage your time to achieve your set goals. William Penn, an English colonial proprietor, said that time is what we want most, but what we use worst. So, use your time wisely. Charles Richards also said, and I quote, Don't be fooled by the calendar. There are only as many days in the year as you make use of. One man gets only one week's value out of a year, while another man gets a full year's value out of a week. In this video, I'll share with you 10 time management tips for achieving your goals. This, I believe, will help you become a successful person. If you're new here, consider subscribing so that you won't miss other interesting videos like this. 1. Set your goals the right way Setting goals is important in time management. However, there is a right way and a wrong way to set goals. When you set goals the right way, you'll do a good job making the best use of your time. To help you set goals properly, you can follow the SMART rule. S. Specific M. Measurable A. Achievable R. Realistic T. Time-bound When your goals follow this pattern, you will end up achieving them and maximizing the best use of your time. 2. Wake up early Have you considered making your day longer than others by waking up earlier than the rest of the world? Let's start by waking up 15 minutes earlier than our usual time. You can use the additional time to meditate, exercise and plan the day. Doing this will help increase your daily productivity and time management will no longer be a problem. Jack Dorsey, co-founder and CEO of Twitter and Square, wake up at 5 a.m. to meditate, exercise, make coffee and then check in for his workday. Also, Dwayne The Rock Johnson is already in the gym by 4 a.m. to get an edge on the competition. 3. Set your priorities Your priorities are the list of things that you must accomplish by the end of the day. One of the reasons why waking up early is good is because you get to plan your day properly instead of just rushing out to work and then trying to sort things out in your head on the move. You see, there will never be enough time to accomplish all your tasks of the day. So ranking them according to their importance and urgency will help you determine what should be done and what could be done at the end of the day. 4. Take out your MIT in the morning Once you are done setting your priorities, the next step is to take out your most important task, MIT, of the day as early as possible. Mark Twain once said, and I quote, If it's your job to eat a frog, it's best to do it first thing in the morning. And if it is your job to eat two frogs, it is best to eat the biggest one first. The point is to tackle your MIT in the morning so that it will give you the momentum to help you sail through the rest of the day. 5. Plan your entire week Walk into work with a plan for the week will help you focus on priorities. You can easily transition from your carefree weekend mindset to a productive Monday morning work brain. Put the important task on Monday. Use Tuesday and Wednesday to sort out creative exercises. Fix meetings for Thursdays when your energy level is dropping already and on Fridays, plan and network. 6. Get rid of distractions Distractions come in different forms such as emails, meetings and the likes. They sound like important things but they can serve as distractions instead. So, for instance, you can put your phone away when you have a task to complete or set out time aside to respond to your emails and the likes. 7. Take frequent breaks when working To keep your mental, emotional and physical states at peak levels, you need to learn to take breaks from time to time because if you don't, you might break down and when this happens, you'll end up having a pile of work to do. This affects entrepreneurs especially. They think they need to run from place to place to get things done. Yes, maybe they need to. But they also need to learn to take breaks from time to time to improve productivity. 8. Don't multitask. John Tom Breakers said, and I quote, 
Multitasking is great in the kitchen when you are trying to time the chicken to be ready at the same time as the potatoes, but do not assume it is a great way to manage a workday. Remember, quality over quantity. Your goal should be to complete one task successfully with a perfect finish and all that stuff, rather than doing so many half-done, poorly finished jobs. So, multitasking, contrary to what we believe, isn't a good way to effectively manage your time. Take your tasks one at a time. 9. Exercise in the morning Several studies report that exercise increases your energy level and boosts your metabolism so that you won't find yourself feeling weak and tired when the day isn't even half over. Daily meditation and physical exercise are a great way to maintain a physical and mental balance that renders efficient performance. 10. Turn off your social media apps when working Yes, we want to find out what other people are doing and what our competitors are doing to get more customers and the likes, but most of the time, we end up getting caught in our social media feeds and before we even realize what's happening, we we'll spend the entire day doing nothing but scrolling through our social media feed. To effectively manage your time, first of all, find out what is taking your time and then start by setting goals and plans to help use your time wisely. Also remember that Alan Lakin, author of How to Get Control of Your Time and Life, said, Time equals life. Therefore, waste your time and waste your life or master your time and master your life. Thank you so much for watching our videos. If you like this channel, we're happy to announce to you that our team has launched three other interesting channels. One of our new channels is called Hunt TV, where we publish inspirational videos to inspire and encourage you as you go through the harsh journey of life. Our second channel is called Fame TV, where we share with you the interesting and inspiring stories and biographies of the successful people who have achieved greatness with their lives. Our third channel is called Money TV, which is a channel designed to use more dramatic video clips to teach you about money. Look at the description box to join our three new channels. We love you.